pervasive developmental, pervasive developmental disorders in neurology. We have two kinds of major categories. We have polyodystrophy and leukodystrophy, whether you are affecting the gray matter or you are affecting the white matter. They are normal growing children and all of a sudden they have a decline and this decline is pervasive and is continuous. We have three major subtypes of the leukodystrophies and they are presenting by simply um, the, the affection of the white matter. So they are the long tract, bilateral pyramidal, cerebellar dysfunction and affection of the optic nerve with progressive loss of vision. These are the, the three triads. One of the commonest among them is the metachromatic leukodystrophy. Always remember that name because metachromatic leukodystrophy presents itself with a typical schizophrenia for many years before developing bilateral parameter. It's a very famous in neurology that this disorder does not present with bilateral parameter. It presents with schizophrenia, typical classical schizophrenia with positive and negative symptoms of schizophrenia and receive treatment for schizophrenia for many years and then start to develop bilateral pyramidal that can be missed for extra pyramidal rigidity. It's a metachromatic and the radiology is showing the uh, dissolution of the white matter around and that's why radiological examination is very, is very important as the workout for patients who had no previous psychiatric history and particularly if there is poor response to treatment.